Okay, so I have completely lied to you guys. And this is what I'm doing now. So we're gonna be doing some projects in the house. We have to, I gotta get this stuff done. It's to be able to buy a new property. So I did lie. I said it was gonna be all outdoors and that's all that we're doing. Eh, oh well, I guess you guys are just gonna to have to watch or not watch, I don't care. Anyways, so what we're doing today is we need to get the stuff off of these walls so that we can cut out the baseboard down here um, to open it up. We want to give it some room so that we can get air in there um, and breathe. The smell has gone down since it's happened uh, with just stuff being wet and damp. And uh, But we're going to be moving all this stuff off the wall so we can cut this out. We're only going to be cutting up a little bit just to open it up to get some air movement in there. And then we just have these little spots. Um, I already did one there. I showed you guys that in the last one. Um, you can see the jet re is right there and uh, the ring light but we got another one here and then there's just a couple small sections on this side that's all that we need to do but today we're going to be getting this stuff off the walls and cutting those walls and we'll be back here in a minute So while we were back over here, you saw us moving that big bookshelf um, in that back corner. I wasn't able to move that on my own. It's extremely heavy. Um, Byron was helping me and there's foam underneath it. Well, we pulled up the foam mats and they're horrendous. So um, I'm going to have to get these foam mats up and get them out of the basement as well and try to get this floor dried up because it's just holding water over there in the corner. But we're going to get back to it and get working on that.
All right, so as you can see, we got everything here in the center of the room. We pulled up all of the flooring tiles. So those, that's completely done. Um, we got them out, we got them in the garage. I'm saving everything, that way I can show the assur insurance adjuster. We got a date for the insurance adjuster. They called me, so on the 12th at 9 a.m. or 10 a.m., I have to look and see, I got it on my phone. We're going to be, he's gonna be coming out and then he's gonna take a look at everything and then I can start figuring out how I'm gonna fix this. Um, I didn't think until I was down here and started moving stuff that those like gym floor mats that I had on there that you guys have seen me do before um, in the basement, that those were gonna hold the water underneath them and apparently they did. So the smell started going away, but as soon as we started lifting those up, what happened, Byron? There was more water and more moisture. You could definitely smell it. It was not, didn't smell good. So we had to take those out. We had to get them out of the house. Um, we're trying to get everything cleaned up. We're gonna start cutting into the walls now and we're gonna get that done. Yeah. All right, so what I'm doing is, I'm not even sure what this is. It looks like it's framed in, but this drywall, I'm gonna take the knife and I'm gonna run it across and cut out the bottom section so that air can get up into this wall cavity um, there is some holes and stuff but it's not it's not enough so we're just going to go up a little bit um, the insurance company may tell me differently that they want me to go up higher and i'm not being perfect with it dude this isn't drywall that's a piece of wood panel yeah it's wood paneling wood paneling it's not cutting well, that's a surprise. We might have to do this one a little bit different. That's why I was confused. You can see there's a little ledge on this. So I don't know exactly what that is, but... Um, that's surprising, isn't it? It is. I don't know why this is different. Yeah. No, that's drywall. Is it? Okay. All right, well, we're gonna to move to the next one then and we're gonna give that a shot and then we'll have to, we'll maybe have to come back to this later and uh, figure out what we're gonna do with this. I don't know if this whole section might just have to come out, but we're gonna find out. All right, so we're gonna try in this section. We know this is wood. This is completely different than this is. So we're gonna, um, we're gonna try to give this a cut here and see if we can get into it. Yep. I'm nervous about the wall caving in. We're gonna find out though. Like I said, the insurance company may say that I gotta go higher. I just wanna get these walls open though. And I can go back with a drywall knife, the saw, and uh, kinda get it. Let's see if we can get a section out of here. I may have scored that enough. Get a pry bar. all the brick behind it. And you see all the nails along the edge here.
So as you've seen, we've been going around, we've been removing all the drywall and some of the wood uh, paneling that's on it. I'll show you over here. You can see we got this whole wall done, got to cut up a couple inches, going all the way down there. And then we got, I started over on this side and I got that done, but in that back corner over by where the tripod is, we got this wall here done and we got this done. And then I had this section already cut out. So uh, Byron just went up and got a couple buckets. We're gonna be putting the debris into the buckets um, kind of smashing it down in there and we're gonna get it out to the garage and finish cleaning up here So you're gonna see us do a little bit of that. I saw recording when it was not charging Okay, so Byron and I, we did some work. Yep. A little bit. You saw we got the walls cut out. Um, we got all put into the garbage. We got a pile of stuff over here that needs to be uh, replaced, I guess. Luckily, we didn't lose too much stuff. We also have everything in the center. Everything's open. So now on September 12th, the... Uh, Insurance adjuster is going to be coming and uh, maybe I'll film that while he's here. I don't see why I wouldn't be able to right, right. Yeah. So uh, maybe I'll maybe I'll do that and then I'll let you guys know what's going to be happening as we go along But you can see the floor No more carpet No more gym floor So that flood stunk um, It smells a ton better down here yep. now like it was really bad before. It's starting to get better. It's starting to air out a little bit. Um, have had heaters running, stuff running. So we got to get these walls dried out a little bit better. They're open. But this little heater that I got, tell them about that little oh, heater. Oh, little heater made it hot in here. It's drying out. It's just really small. This heater was thirteen dollars at Walmart. It was twelve ninety nine. The thing, and you've seen it in the videos, but it's a it's an itty bitty little. It's over here. Right here. Uh, it's a Polonis, is what it's called. I think that's how it's pronounced. Polonis. <laughs> but anyways, slime on everybody. We're gonna get going. We gotta go somewhere tonight. That's right. We got something going on, so we gotta go to that. And then we got something going on tomorrow. A couple things. Stay tuned to that. We'll stay tuned. Get the video. Yeah, we're gonna be doing some fishing. Yep. And other stuff. So I don't know. It's it might be crazy. But anyways, see you in the next one. Bye.